What's up guys? Welcome to Draw School episode 4 where I will be teaching you guys how to draw the nose. We are getting to the point where I will be giving away an Illo sketchbook to one of you subscribers. So thank you so much for the likes, for the subscribes, for the comments. I appreciate you as I am continually trying to get better at this. Whew! So let's get started. So we are drawing noses today. I have my lovely reference over here to the left breaking things down into shapes before we get into the detail so when looking at a nose it's a triangle we're going to talk about different angles in a little bit so you got a triangle then you have the wing the tip of the nose and of course you build it out from there we're going to call this the bridge the tip the wings so that is the basic shapes so you have a triangle and two circles so you bring down the line from the bridge go around the tip around the wing to the bottom of the nose. Here you create the nostril and you just tuck the tip into the nostril, you meet at the ends here and voila, you have a nose real quick. It's just how you insert the rest of the face after that. Okay, so that's using reference, that reference right there. Let's just talk about in general. Drawing a nose from straightforward. So this is our straightforward person. We're drawing this nose. Okay, so for that nose, you start with a triangle and you draw the nose tip with the circle and then you draw the two nose wings with other circles but from this angle you can probably see a little bit of under the nose here so you want to draw like a little space like that under that's going to be in the shadow so that's the basic shape so let's get into detail because in reality you don't want to draw all those lines then it's, just, it's not going to look correct so what you do is you figure out where things go and the only lines you're really gonna see, the darkest lines of your nose are gonna be the nostril. So let's say the nostrils are here for this particular nose because we all know noses come in all different shapes and sizes, which is why it is important that you look at reference. But in general, you got your nostrils, which are dark. You have the wings of your nose that come out like this. Now I would say, that's it. You're not drawing anything else. Everything else is gonna be done with shading before tutorial purposes you know you throw that in there and then there's usually a line here and then all this is going to be in shadow and then if you want to throw the bridge of the nose what i meant by you're only going to draw these lines and the rest is going to be in shadow is this let me add some shading and we'll talk about it so you see these areas right here are really the only super dark areas. The rest you form with light and shadow and shading and you create a nose. Unless you're drawing cartoons. If you're drawing cartoons, then by all means, get in there and throw some lines, you know? If we're doing a, a side nose for a side face, this nose, it's a triangle. It's connected to the top of your, like over your mouth area. Then you have the wing, tip of the nose. I guess you guys should know that the reason we have a bridge of the nose is because of the skull and how it how it sits. So this is the bridge of the nose right here. This area right here. For this, I would just draw the wing of the nose and the nostril. Kind of goes in this soup like this. And it's dark and it goes up to that. And like I said, it's basically the wing and the nostril. So let me add some shading to this. We'll be back. So there is a side nose. Let's do a top nose, why don't we? So a top nose would be, if you guys watched the last episode or the episode on angles, then you would know that this is the hardest angle for me to draw. Basically, this is just a triangle. Still, still a triangle. Tip of the nose, wings. It just looks like a Zelda triangle now. Tip of the nose, wings, nostrils. And this shape differs from human being to human being. So again, it depends on the person you're drawing. But if you're creating your own characters, you get to have fun. Dark nostrils, little shading, and voila! That's basically all you're going to be able to see from that nose there. And depending on where the light is coming from, then all this is going to be in shadow. You know, if it's coming from under light, then all this is going to be in light it really depends on the light i can't say shade it this way every time but as long as you're showing form and it looks like a nose and it's attached to other features the mouth is here then you'll be able to tell that's a nose if not you'd probably think it's one of those things that run around in super mario brothers where's that can't leave out the bottom so if your head's like this you're looking down and your nose is there eyebrows are here guess what it's a triangle 
All right, so you have the bridge of nose come down where it attaches to your face there. Tip of the nose, wings, that's it. I almost don't even have to shade this guy. Just the bridge of the nose will hold most of the highlight. Boom, highlight. Then it's just foreshortened to lesson in the future. There you go, looking down nose. And I think that's it on noses, really. I believe that is it on noses. I guess I'll just finish off this nose and I will see you guys on the next video. Thanks for watching. Perfect. that's it guys hopefully you guys learned a lot about how to draw noses on the next one i will be teaching you guys how to draw the mouth also i will be announcing the winner of the illo sketchbook so stay tuned make sure that you subscribe hit the like button and leave me some comments i'll see you guys on the next one